Testing, testing, one, two. Testing, testing, one, two. Do you hear me? Do you hear me? Testing, testing, one, two. Testing, testing, one, two. Do you hear me? Do you hear me? Ah, nothing beats classical music, I tell you. So welcome, everybody, to the King of Macho the First Show. I'm your host, Macho, on TikTok, and today we have a good one. Are Dominicans a race? Are Dominicans a race? Look, on TikTok, Dominicans and race are a hot topic. I mean, if you want views, all you have to mention is Dominicans and race, and it gets views. TikTok is a different audience. I understand it. I've been dropping lives for quite some time. I need to get back to doing videos, though. That's one thing. I think I've been concentrating too much on lives. I love it because I put it on my show. Follow me on YouTube. Came out to the first show on YouTube as well. So I like to upload the lives and, you know, people get to watch a show format there. Uh, but I will start doing um, videos as well. Um, you know, I can't forget, you know, people's favorite, you know, when people know me, what do they know me for? I'm a Vende Patria hunter. And, you know, I've kind of um, slowed down on the Vende Patria. Like, I haven't really gone after Vende Patria. I haven't been active Vende Patria hunting. Because it's not as much as it used to, but they still exist. And, you know, sometimes people are younger than me. I don't really like to do that, but I've seen some stuff. For some Vende Patrias out there that we have to address. Remember, still season five, colonization. But I have to come out with Vende Patria hunting season, what, seven? Seven. The Awakening, that's what it's called. It's going to be called The Awakening. It's going to come out this month on my YouTube channel. I do lives on YouTube. And um, in that format, it's more of a podcast type. Uh, TikTok is different, you know, I just pop up and just talk to the people and do whatever. Uh, so follow me on YouTube, King Macho the First Show. Now, the man on, my, on that screen is Friar Montesinos. He's renowned, you know, uh, for fighting for the rights of the natives, um, for suffering the abuses from the Spanish or the Portuguese or the army, you know, whoever, um, so he was a friar that spoke up for the rights of the uh, natives that lived there. So clap it up for Mr. Friar Montesinos. <laughs> That's in the Dominican Republic. You can find that in Santo Domingo in the Malecón area. Um, beautiful, beautiful uh, statue. It's like facing the Atlantic Ocean. Uh, and, you know, just vast ocean. Uh, and, it's, and it's amazing. So, are Dominicans a race? That's the topic of the show. I believe, I've always said, yes, we are. Because even within other Hispanics, we have our own uh, phonetic features. And we have our own uh, just way of being. I, I like to say, being Dominican is a way of life. It's a way of life. It's much more than people try to make a racial mixture and all that stuff. They try to try to limit us to race. Being Dominican, in its essence, especially when you have, you know, one hundred percent Dominican blood, you know, you feel it. You feel it. Um, I've always said that. I, I always said that we have certain features and certain things, mimics and everything, uh, that make us unique. We are a unique people. I've always said that. You know, my, my whole brand was separating myself from the rest. You know, King Macho, the first show. The, you know, then I started calling myself the Conquistador. It was colonization, right? Colonization. And what really motivated me is because the haters, they knocked down my channel. I had two strikes because of, you know, certain copyright issues or certain, um, I, I mentioned you know, about the whole lockdown, you know, a jab thing. And then a hater came, you know, and struck it down. It was over. So I was like, King Macho was, you know, they thought they ended, they ended King Macho, but who rises was Macho el Conquistador. 
you know. So I started putting that out there, really, you know, kind of like trolling people with it. And it's now it's in the lexicon. Clap it up for myself. And you're going to hear it, people. You're going to hear it, watch. You're going to start hearing, oh, conquistador this. But you, you're witnessing who said it first and who put it out there. With the Dominican flag, of course. You know, so for me, I always felt that we are a race of our own people, you know, within our own people. Because if you think about it, right, it's a small country, you know, relatively small. So you have these families, you know, the Martinez's, the Los Perez, Los Santos, eh, Cruz, Ramirez, Fernandez, Hernandez, Rodriguez, Polanco, all kind of like intermixing with each other. And these are people, if you think about it, that carry a certain genetics. The base genetics is from a certain part of Spain, which is, I think, Galicia. I would say Galicia. I would say the Spanish Galicia. I think it is. I don't know. You, you tell me. Galicia. <laughs> and then they mix with, the, you know, with certain populations or some didn't really mix. They stay within themselves. And you had this mixing that, and that's been going on for, for so many uh, centuries. It develops its own thing. You know, so I believe Dominicans are a race. If you want to, you know, if you if you agree or disagree, you could come up here and uh, express yourself. Let's see. Un, dos, banda que el dominicana no anda en gente... Que lo que mi dominicano, dímelo, dímelo. Hit that like button too. Hit that like button too. Um, so, what I hear all the time on social media, right? Social media is the attack on Dominicans. It, it involves race. It involves uh, that we uh, don't recognize or put forth our African side as much as our Spanish side. Um, that that's not really true. That's not really true. Um, I just think that the base culture is Spanish, right? Now, you might have some browner people or darker people that are under the Spanish culture, which has developed into a Croyo culture within itself. It's not, it's not synonymous with Spain. Of course, things have changed, you know, um, but the base of it is Spain, Right? But the African side we show because one, you look at someone's skin color, they, they already have African traits and genes. Right? That that's undeniable. Even people who might be so mixed, but they have a high, you know, a higher percentage of, of African, um, you know, might look lighter. So this is this is why I say how Dominicans don't deny their blackness. Um, is it a pro black country? No. It's a Hispanic country. Hispanic. You know, we know what Hispanic countries are. So when they try to put us in a race, uh, specifically black, they're trying to take Dominican Republic out of Hispanic um, centers or spheres and put them into black spheres. It's like a transfer, like a trade. Or a snatch, kind of. So when I say Dominicans are racist, um, what is racism? I want to hear what pe what what do people consider what racism is? Are we all a race? Just different breeds? Do you ask yourself? What was first? The white dog or the, or the black dog? Or the brown one? How about a bird? Which one came first? Was it a black one? A white one, a red one, a blue one, a yellow one? Which one came first? What came first too? The whale, the shark? We know what kind of shark came first. And this is why the uh, talk of race is really low IQ. It's very surface. Uh, 
It's like we make genetics into this physical thing when it's also biological. We make it a physical thing. Biology. This is why um, they had eugenics programs back then was because there was the desirables and the undesirables, right? And that meant that, you know, as a as a parent, you have kids, who do you want them to get? You you want to get you want them to get with somebody in a higher echelon because you you probably have to be smart to be there. So if you get two smart people to have kids, most likely you're going to have good parents. Most you know, you're going it's going to you know, it's going to trickle down. You know, so you what is race then? That, and that's what I'm asking the people. What is what does race mean to you? Hey Marjorie, what's going on? Red, that's funny. W Macho, dímelo, 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 dímelo. How was that vacation? Yeah, no, it was good. It was good. I can, you know, I kind of lay off TikTok a little bit. You know, TikTok. I think like I set out to do something, you know, kind of put the more Dominicans on to do their own lives and to do this and to do that. And, you know, I was one of the kind of the original. I'm not going to say I'm the original, but I was kind of the one of the originals, you know, and then I kind of, you know, people started doing their own thing. And this is what and so that like my shows on TikTok aren't really necessary. Now it's more like, oh, let's have some fun. Let's just talk. I think when I used to do it, it was very necessary. You know, so, you know, congrats to all those Dominicans now doing lives, have their own stuff, put out their own videos. We have a lot more people kind of waking up. Shout out to us, man. Shout out to us. This is what the new order, this is what the new order really, you know, set out to do. It's the fact that we, you know, we're not from a fancy university. We're not working with organizations. You know, we don't get grants. And, you know, and they have all the money in the world to put out content, uh, whether it be on, on, on mainstream media, social media, uh, appearances, talks, you name it. We don't have that. We came in with a mission like, look. They're coming out with a lot of propaganda against Dominicans. We have to even the score. We have to come out with exposing that propaganda, who's doing it, fight back that propaganda, like fight fire with fire, and even the score. And I think even though TikTok is still, uh, you know, politically it, it leans t- towards a certain way, but I think we've done a great job of telling it how it is People hearing our side of the story and also debunking a lot of lies out there. Shout out to us. <laughs> and this is what I say, people. This is a marathon. This this thing is not going to go away. Um, and you have to put that in your brain. Now, it's a marathon. It's a marathon. You, know, you have to run every mile, every mile consistently you know change up your pace some from here and there but you know you you have to know this is a a long haul like issue and 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 it hasn't even got it's getting worse but it hasn't reached its penis its zenith yet oh we're not there yet it's coming but we're not there yet because it's coming now, Dominicans and race. I've not, growing up, I never heard Dominicans were racist. I never heard it. You know, uh, I, what I what I what was the the kind of thing to say back then about Dominicans was that them and Puerto Ricans are the same, but they're always fighting. Like, oh, Puerto Ricans are like Dominicans. Dominicans. It, it was even in movies. The whole Dominican and Haitian thing, that's recent. That's recent because of the 2012 earthquake, the mass uh, migration into the Dominican Republic, the rights to be Dominican, you know, ch- kind of changing the constitution because so many needed to be saved. 
They had no other choice. So we have to change our constitution to fit, you know, them. That I don't know where that's done. I don't know what country. If people could name a country besides the U.S., the U.S. is the number one economy in the world. Let's not even use the U.S. Name me another country in the world where you're changing laws to naturalize citizens and just kind of like take over that, that ethnicity. I, I don't know. You, you tell me. Because this is more than immigration. So after that, they start saying, oh, well, Dominicans and, and Haitians are alike and stuff. And Like, you never heard that. And that's because of the migration. So all this stuff about we always remember that, that's, that's not true. It's <laughs> just far. Like, in the 80s, no one really talked about Haiti. Like, they did it. We, Dominicans never did. Never. 90s, nope. 2000s, nope. After earthquake 2010, 2012, you know, that whole 2010 era, that's, that's when it really, like, started. And that's when the whole racism thing started. Because it's all about Haitians. You know, so that's when the, I think the racism thing started versus, uh, you know, Dominicans. Dominican spirit needs to be alive. A lot of Dominican work in the world. And I am more. What's going on? Dímelo, man? macho. Yo estoy bien, loco. Dímelo. Dímelo, dímelo. I'm reborn, baby. I feel, I feel happy as hell. Man, that's yo. That's great to hear, bro. Man, congrats, congrats on that, man. Yeah, man. He, hold on, let me turn. Yeah, I'm chilling, bro. You know, like, man, I'm just getting the bills paid. Things are, you know, coming through. Things are coming together. I'll probably, no. uh, I'll talk to East Haitian about moving to DR next year. So. Oh, really? Nice, man. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Yeah, you know it's sweet, man. If you if you have a a, a sweet remote job where you could travel anywhere and work, it's I mean beautiful. That, that's the move. That is that is the move. I would not. I wouldn't even think it twice. I mean, like, oh, remote anywhere, DR. Eso es la que tengo la camisa, eh? You already know, bro. Let's go. <laughs> no, no, that's what's up, man. And, and honestly, like. You know, and I'm not joking. You know, people think that when Dominicans want to, like, move back and, and they prefer to live there, they, we do. Like, yeah, we, and it's we, not undoing what our parents did. We're just trying to restore order on what's going on back home. You know, like, if there's things that need to get fixed, there's things that need to get fixed, you know? So. No, no, I, I, I agree. And, um, yeah, that's what we were talking about. I said Dominicans are a race. Um I think Dominicans are their own entity. Like, and I was explaining to the people that back in the 80s, 90s, 2000s, uh, the only thing, like, bad thing they used to say about Dominicans was like, oh, they don't like Puerto Ricans or Puerto Ricans don't like yeah. them. And mm -hmm. the reasons they said it, like, even from outsiders, oh, Puerto Ricans are more American as you guys wear no socks with shoes. You wear no socks and shoes. You know, like, the hicks and stuff and... Yeah, you know that was. They're like, Americanized. Kind of like, we're traditional. Like they're like little. They can't speak Spanish. They don't know how to cook. They don't know yeah. how to dance. We know how to cook. We know how to dance. We know how to fuck. We know how to make food. You know, like all those things. So you know, that, like, that it was, was a little rivalry, and then it evolved with social media. With oh, you're racist, xenophobic, all these little buzzwords from the woke community. I'm like, ah, oh, shit. Look at what we got going now. So you know, like it's all this Afrocentric bullshit. But it's it's not just Afrocentric. It's it's all the liberal media, you know, that though. No, I, I definitely agree, bro, because I was mm -hmm. I was telling uh, people that this kind of started when um the earthquake happened. 2010, yeah. Mm -hmm. In 2010, I believe. Um, mm -hmm. And that's when it started becoming this, oh, it's one island, uh, you know, you guys are brothers. That's when I really started hearing it. And I was a, a grown man when I started hearing that. Like when and I we were the kids. first ones to help them. We had trucks, we had cars sending aid, la comida, the rice, the water, the canned foods. We were the first one to go, first ones. And then everybody wanted to start helping out. And then, but they didn't help out before then when Haiti was in poverty. 
Haiti was fucked up. They were in a they were in a state of deficit even before the earthquake, you know, yeah. in Port-au-Prince. So they can't call us that when that's our side of the island to begin with. That land itself is already ours, predating the Spaniards even coming there. That's still our shit over there. Just the people on the left side. Just have it. Yeah, it's like uh like uh what's it called? They're squatting. <laughs> <laughs> Squatters. <laughs> Squatters. <laughs> Yo, okay. you know what? They they punch. It's them. not illegal to be poor over there. It's not illegal. It's not illegal to be poor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. it's but. normalized. Like misery is normalized. You know, mm -hmm. um, and they punted on the on their country. Like they punted. Like they scrapped it. I think, and that's why they're pressuring DR and Dominicans to kind of like take them in because and incorporate them in our country because they they punted. United Nations told us, and then we told them no. Man, we told yeah. them no. You got to do it. You got to do it right. You got to yeah. document these people, right? Can't just infiltrate, take our shit, and then harm our people, and then say, oh, if we stop helping you, we're racist, quote unquote, DK. That's bullshit. That's bullshit. I think it's bullshit. Yeah, you know, so the, 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 I think that's where the whole Dominicans are racist thing came from. Uh, I think that's when they really started using that language, because before that, I never used to hear that Dominicans are racist. No, Everyone not even that. those buzzwords you from know, the left. They used to say Dominicans are black. They used to yeah. say, "Yo, look, make us on." The, so how can they, we be racist if we're black? We don't they, hold they any systemic say, institutional say, power. So the thing is, is what about, you know what's different about this? Is it, it was a Hispanic thing though? Still, it was within our community. Mm -hmm. Now, with the AAs and the Haitians coming in via the Haitians, the AAs are coming in via the vessel of the Haitians. Mm -hmm. Now they're within our community trying to dictate shit. Yeah, they're trying to dictate. So what they're, what's happening is that they're using their race to divide our ethnicity to say, this person's a black Hispanic, this person's a white Hispanic, but we were all interchangeably getting along before all these ideologies start coming up now. So a Hispanic was a Hispanic. It wasn't an Afro, Latino, Afro. It was just Latino. That's it. It was in all colors. So they, they, made, a, they made a differentiation saying Afro this, Afro that. You know what I'm saying? Or, or Euro this or Euro that. Like, oh, you're Euro oh, Dominican. You're, or you're, you're a white Dominican. You're a white right. Dominican. You're a white Dominican or you're, you're a, a white black, Puerto Rican. Like mm -hmm. You're a white Mexican. And I These identity that. politics are dividing us the way the black community divides itself. And we don't want that. That's it. We don't want that. Just because they're in shambles, in respectfully, I'm just saying, the division that takes place in that community, they're trying to project that onto us. We don't want that. We don't, we don't need to be... We don't need to be dominated by some other culture to tell us what to do. Oite. No, because the way we got along is the way we progressed. We progressed a lot further. That's why in an argument, they would say all Hispanic communities are better off. Hispanic men are better off and things like that. Does that make sense? Like all Hispanics in America, they make more money. Hispanics in America have a higher chance of getting a job. Hispanics in America. Uh, they take care of their families. Hispanic men are more of a provider. Hispanic, you know, all these things. So they all use these, like, these demographics to, like, argue and compare and contrast from each and every race. And we, we are spoke about as a race. For example, they would say, you know, all whites, uh, Latino, Asian, whatever, we're treated as a race, even though, quote, unquote, we're not. We're an ethnic group. You know what I'm saying? We're still we're we're still having that recognition as a race. That's the label itself, when they want to uh, differentiate from people, if that makes any sense. So, me no black, me Dominican. Me no, you know, soy negro, papi, you know, soy negro. Eat. That's why that's why he's screaming <laughs> the statue right there. Me no black, me Dominican. I'm no black. <laughs> <laughs> But like, like I said, like I said, uh, like I said before, you know, like we all come with three admixtures and any, any ideology that's too patriotic over the other, it ruins the entire cuisine. Like I said before, the whole plate of food, la plato, para la comida. If there's too much of, if there's too much sauce of anything, it ruins the entire meal. So it's all balanced in one, three and one. There you go. No, that that's true, and um, you know, look, 
I've been about, uh, around racist people. People who, like, make jokes about putting you in a pickup truck, uh, you know, putting you in a, or, or telling you, you know, I want, I want to grape your mom or uh, I want, you know, out of, you out of my country or, and or, or, or you, 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 you speak. I've heard it. So I know what racism is. Our identity politics from the woke left is bringing division back. And that's not something we want. I don't think that's something we want. We didn't ask for that. We didn't, we didn't, they violate, they violated our consent. We didn't give you permission to do that. We didn't give them the authority to do that. So no, you know, we just want to be left alone. Have us do what we need to do and have us progress as a country. We all get along. We all come in all colors. Same thing with Puerto Rico, same thing with Cuba and other countries in the Caribbean. And that's it. So. Yeah, definitely. And I think we're, we're going to have a confederation of the Antilles um, re, um, redone. We're gonna we're gonna redo it some later on in the future though. I think that's coming. Cause I think right now we are really in the past with DR mm -hmm. and also too with Puerto Rico. Um, the the neo colonization of driving out Puerto Ricans, putting public land in private. No, because it's it's being Americanized over there. Like the natives in Puerto Rico, they're being priced out of their own land. They're being priced out of their own home. Can they even afford their own water? Can they even afford their own rent? That's their shit. Oite. So it's becoming an American standard of things when it shouldn't be. So, yeah. And then, you know, you have Cuba with the communism. Hopefully, sooner or later, they open up because if um, Cuba opens up, you know, and I hopefully, you know, the Cuban American community is still very Cuban. They'll they'll go in there and take a, a nice chunk of it because they've been doing very well here in the United States. They have a lot of power, you know, relatively. And I hope so, man, because if they open up, it, it's going to change the whole aspect of Latin America, I think, you know, Cuba. You know, free Cuba. No one really screams it that much. Free. Yeah, Cuba. no, you got a free Cuba too. They always free talk Cuba, about free Haiti, free Congo. Good. Free Cuba, man. They have a government, like they have actually some sort of stability. But damn, they fucking rob they're robbing so much. It's not even. It's not even funny how openly they, you know they're robbing. So free Cuba, Cuba libre, Cuba libre. That's why you're screaming right there, Cuba libre. ¿Dónde está los cuero? <laughs> yeah man so everybody hit like share subscribe follow me on youtube i'm back weekly uh i drop a show um and there's more like um educative i say we we do investigative journalism of sorts I'm gonna have an interesting one next week books that are banned in the dominican republic Ooh. forbidden it's called the forbidden knowledge so we're going to showcase certain books that have kind of disappeared from dominican republic's uh libraries you could say and we're going to present them and hopefully uh people after the show i'll post it on twitter i'll post it on tiktok could read those books because these are the books that they don't want dominicans to read you know so um we're we're going to showcase that next week and then after that, I'm going to have a special one. Is it season six colonization still? Or season five? Yeah, season five, yeah. It's, it's going to be maybe another, hopefully knocking on wood, another one and a half, two years. Oh, wow. Yeah, it's going to be like, I mean, you could, you, if it was a, a series, it would be the double disc version. <laughs> yeah, because, you know, when you colonize, it's basically you're taking, you're taking over. You have no enemies. That's right. So we cannot skip steps. We're still in colonization. And this is the toughest part. There's going to be, it's like running in a, in a, when you run a marathon, this is like mile five. And it's like, you know, those first two miles were kind of hard. And then the third one, now you're going up a hill. And, it, you know, it's so one. Your body one, adapts at that point. Yeah. And so we're kind of got to get used to it. So um, it's been a year, almost a year. I'll still go for another. And um, season six, I already have it written. I know what everything's going to be about. And this one's going to be 
a little even more outrageous. So uh, prepare for that because my conquistador colonizer thing is, is taking. Even people say, hey, when I when I mentioned Tainos, oh, you know, the Tainos, oh, I thought you guys were conquistadors. I was like, Shh, you I tengo la sangre, you tengo la sangre. I actually have to go sometime. But yeah, it's, um, you know, now we're, we're heavy on Twitter and the same thing is happening over there is, you know, we get a, a group of haters and they try to dox you, they try to knock your stuff down. It, it is what it is. I'm, I'm well seasoned in this game, I like to say. And um, the haters, right, they just don't like that Dominicans are defending themselves. They want us to be quiet. They want us just everything to just roll over. And it's not going to happen. And it's, you know, it's sad to see that certain Dominicans get disrespected online. Like, mm -hmm. they're disrespecting Dominicans. And you still side with the opposition. Clap it up for them, man. Okay. That's like beyond Lambon. Lambon. That's like, I, I don't know, a, a cuck. I, I, not even that. I, I would, <laughs> in the party, that's yo, yeah, like, uh, it's just like, damn, they're dissing, like, they're saying, oh, your woman are this, your mom, your, your tia, mm -hmm. your this. And you've seen this on the timeline, and you're Dominican, and you're like, yeah, you'll show those Dominican nationalists. I'm like, wait, what? I'm like, yo, he's dissing your mother. I don't diss your mom and, and your thing. I don't. I wouldn't oh, take that, okay, bro, bro. I wouldn't take that, bro, bro. <laughs> that's crazy that's crazy as some people think but it is what it is um even during the, the times of duarte uh, Meya, and sanchez that that was happening too it was dominicans that just didn't want to fight they, they, they didn't want to they live you know whatever they didn't do it you know so it, it is what it is people it's, create hard times <laughs> yeah it's like it's only the few really it's, it's only the few man the few and that's what i say mm -hmm. It is what I say. It's like all this stuff, the, Dominic the Dominicanos, que somos patriotas, somos lo poco, y siempre va a ser lo poco. Don't even think that you're going to wake up thinking, oh, Dominican, that, that's not going to happen. There's going to be more against you than for you. But mm -hmm. the ones that are for you, you know, when you all are in the same frequency and energy, mm -hmm. it's powerful. Very. You know, it's powerful, bro. Dímelo, David, David Cruz. David Cruz, dímelo. David. Yo, what up, man? man? Pero que dicen los dominicanos. Aquí tú sabes, otro día, otra mierda y otro toile, loco. Yeah, mierda. <laughs> Luchando por la lucha de todos los días, de, 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 de los dominicanos. Eso que yo digo, que hacer dominicano va a ser controversial. Yo le dije a la gente, loco, claro. ya claro. después de que este tiempo. Yo ahora? Yo me voy a poner un tatuaje en la cara de la bandera dominicana. <risa> Para que tú veas miedo que yo le tengo a esos babosos. No, es verdad, man. I'm going to get a tattoo in my face like Mike Tyson with Dominican. <laughs> like, you know what's going to say in my forehead? I'm not black, I'm Dominican. Yo no soy negro, papi. Yo soy negro. Yo soy negro. Yo, nobody, yo, people don't Mas understand. Yo, yo, people don't understand something, bro. When when somebody's trying to like like fuck with Dominican bro, we don't we don't put up with that shit. We we don't deal with that shit. We would not let nobody tell us what to do. That's one thing people don't know about We're Dominican. very defiant. We're very we defiant. Not, yo, very yo, yo, very stubborn. Yo soy más bruto que un burro cuando me empiezan a mí. Oye, yo soy yo. I'm mad. Like yo, my wife knows that shit. She 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 takes me the wrong way. She will not. Yo, she won't go nowhere with me. But if you if you do me the right way. You could get anything from me, bro. I'm like, I'm like, I'm like a freaking. Yo soy suavecito, así. Pero cuando a mí me empiezan a apoyar y me sacan este este demonio, yo tengo por dentro. A mí, yo 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 no le tengo miedo al diablo, loco. Yeah. Y, y ya yo y ya yo estoy en ese modo. Yo estoy en modo de guerra ya. Yo no estoy que ya ni que que vaya, que busque. No, no, I will not put up shit for anybody. So all that bullshit that uh, you know they want to change us, they want to like. Like, like get in between, like, you know, what, uh, uh, la, 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 la cultura nosotros. Fuck that shit. No, esa vaina no está conmigo. Hola, Teina. No, no, no. Tú no oyes los dominicanos, loco. You know what pisses me off? You don't hear Dominicans, like, trying to get in between, like, trying to get, like, trying to change anybody from anywhere. We don't know nope. what anybody else does, bro. You don't, you don't hear anybody in, the, in the, on social media telling us what... Like, but you know, but you know what's happening, David? What's we up? have a we have a certain race trying to divide our ethnicity by color, exactly. and that's when not we, when we exactly, and we already 
we already progress that we have interchangeably coincide with each other for a long time. So when you have a woke liberal left from America trying to divide us by colors, exactly. telling us what to do, this is a white Dominican, he can't say the N-word, this is a black Dominican, that's he's it. been oppressed, and yeah. all this other shit. Bullshit. I'm like, nah, bro. You know, it's not, that's like, not gonna work. the fuck alone, bro. That's it's not gonna weird. work with Dominicans. Anyone, anyone in this chat is hearing this, and they, and they, and they think they're gonna change Dominicans, they better, just, they better go to another country and try and change it. That's not going to happen. And we know, you know what? We up, it, Dominicans don't give a shit what anybody else thinks. I personally don't give a shit what anybody else Good evening. That's the bottom line. Hey, macho, how you doing? Hey, guys. Hey, what up? Hey, hello, bro. Hey, hello. Señor, le voy a decir una cosa a ustedes. I need to hear the good news. <laughs> No, 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 that's going to be later, that's going to be later, brother, later, later, later. tiene la boronca, es tigra. No, yo, dije que yo soy tigra. No, 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 estoy cansada. No, yo soy tranquila de mi casa. Adiós, oiga, vea. Yo, yo soy Siba, ella, mire. Adiós, no, vale. Perde. No, está un poquito ocupada, cansada, y llegué de trabajar, tengo un sueñito, pero... Cuando tú solo que el trabajo con sueño, cuando llega a la casa, como que ve la niña, que hay que cocinar, que... como que el sueño se le va a uno, pero normal. Miren, eh, estos individuos, hay que dejarle de hacer caso, porque es que de verdad, mano, una gente que no tiene vida, no tiene identidad, no tiene oficio, lo único que hace en el mundo es donde sea que va, es a criticar y a hablar de la misma mierda. Hay que darle banda. De verdad que sí. eso, eso hubo, hubo una que hizo un video ahí. ¿Cómo que un, una persona eh, que dice, llama, eh, está bien con la palabra negros, eh, tiene tantos seguidores? Y digo uh -huh. yo, entonces no quiero que te digan negra, no quiero que te digan la palabra con la N. Y me acercan, baby. Yo le tengo un nombre a esa gente. Ahora para adelante le voy a cambiar el nombre a los negros. Le voy a, le voy a llamar el blanco oscuro con el cabello manejable. Ella, ¿no? ¿Cómo? ¿Tú me dijiste esa palabra el otro día? Que el blanco oscuro con el cabello manejable. Él me lo dijo en un live. Que blanco yo oscuro con el cabello manejable. Porque imagínate, ¿qué vamos a hacer? No nos no, no vamos a tirar Oye, se quillan si le dicen negro. Se quillan si le dicen la palabra con la N. Se quillan uh -huh. si le dicen afroamericano. Se quillan si le dicen africano. Pues entonces, ¿qué son? Y yo me Macho. doy... ¿Tú sabes lo que me quilla a mí de verdad? A mí lo que me quilla cuando me dicen dominicano, mira. Oye, a mí me da un quille eso. Ay, me da... Ay, ay, ay. <risa> Macho. Tú quieres verme bravo, llámame dominicano para que tú veas. Coño, pero maldita, eh, maldita madre, ¿cómo yo te voy a llamar? Si tú eres haitiano, yo te voy a llamar haitiano. Dilo, dilo. Macho, I have a question for you. Yeah, dímelo. So, I want to talk about the future of this country. So, with Haitians, where do you stand? Do you want them underneath Dominican rule? I know you guys, you guys have mixed feelings about the merger, but like, what do you want to do with them? Like, do you want, obviously, obviously we need to fix a lot of the problems obviously over there but do you want like to have a dominican president on the, on the left because eh? ah, i know like we can't stop what people say about us right so we have to continue and we have to move forward Macho, no se ven los comentarios. anyway um what i think is um that's a tough question. What's what, what's your outcome? What do you want? Do you want to like what's obviously my because the, because in the real, thing in go ahead, go ahead. In the real world is deport all of them and right. fix up Haiti. Right. In a in a in a in a world where you know you, you could grab like a big net. I don't know, Be like the world's mm -hmm, but, <laughs> but the thing is, we're willing to share our shit, right? I will, and, but realistically, you know that's not going to happen. Um, right. And even if you deport 50,000, there's like 30,000 being born a day. Uh, uh, I, I don't know how, how much, like, I think like 300 a day are being born. So it's it eventually, it's like, you know, you're... you're put because I already see kids that are Haitian and Dominican. Like, yeah, I, I see accounts with, like with two flags in one. So it's like, you already see the intermixing that's already taking place. So it's like, what do you do with the left? We might as well assign a Dominican president on the left, fix their shit over there. Cause we deport them out of their country, but their shit's gonna get condens condensed as fuck on the left side. So it's like, I just wanna know like, yeah. how, how is that? How, how is that gonna work? You, you see what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, it's like, look, I've bought it up. 
to certain Dominicans, some Dominicans be like, no, nah, I don't, I don't, I don't mess with that. That's not gonna, you know, and it's like ignoring uh, the problem is not gonna help fix that issue. Yeah, they want to, in a sense, like, like this is what I say: if you live in sure. a two-story home, and someone leaves the faucet upstairs, and the the pre people upstairs don't know how to fix the faucet, right? we gotta fix the basement first, though. and then we it's gonna, gonna start fix the flooding. Foundation. And then, you know, you fix, you know, you you might fix your ceiling so the water can't seep through, but that water's still running. Mm -hmm. You know, so what are you gonna have to do? You're gonna have to go upstairs and turn off the the faucet. You know, and okay. it's the logical. And then you thing. have to call maintenance in the bait in the basement. Yeah, and, and the thing is, the, what's the water happen, pressure? You know, and the thing is, I don't think it's a governmental thing. I don't want the government of the yard to do it, but I want Dominicans to start thinking like of buying land in certain remote parts of Haiti, and exactly. in a way, in a way where, and then if you know, you, you you're gonna. It's, we might as well dominate the real estate market because yeah, the thing is like, they're not willing to share our shit and there's really nothing to share when you really think about it on the left side they really have nothing to give they have that unless, to give. unless unless they're unless they're landmass but their landmass is really ours before the french buccaneers got mm, there good before point. the spaniards before the spaniards got there when you realize that's you our land our, that was our land regardless so we shouldn't even beg or fight for something that's already ours yeah yeah like that, that, that's the thing is is um I yeah, well, like, let me ask you a question though you guys you guys are saying dominicans to buy land in haiti that's what you're saying it's already um, ours i mean there's no, nothing no, no, but to really saying, go ahead let's 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 not go beyond that i'm i'm, I'm trying to catch up with you guys, Here, you, guys ahead, are, you guys are trying to say that for dominicans to start buying land in haiti Okay, this is a question. This is the thing in, the, in Haiti, though. You can't buy land in Haiti because you can't get any paperwork when you buy land in Haiti. You know that, right? They won't let you. This, they and they will let not you. exactly. They will not let you buy land in Haiti if you're not a Haitian. Mm -hmm. Um. So this is where where this. But we're uh, natives to that land, regardless. It's already out. There's, you entiendo, entiendo, like that's yeah, our shit. Even for, for right. much, I, much, I get what you're saying, though. But Macho, mm -hmm. you you realize that Dominicans don't want anything from Haiti, though. We don't want to buy anything. We don't want to take anything. I from agree Haiti. on that part. We don't, don't want, want nothing from there either. Beyond beyond that border, we don't want to buy land over there. We don't want anything beyond that that border. All we want is to. It can mira, mira. I'm gonna be tell you. I'm gonna tell you something. I was one of the person that be like, listen. Ya can go to your side, blah blah blah. Pero esa gente ni helado uno se puede tener loco. No, we don't. I, es I, que estamos alto, ya, ya. Yo estoy alto la misma mierda. This is, this is the thing with Macho. He's saying, what can Dominicans do? The, the, the bottom line is, that Dominicans, we do, the, we do need the government because we need a government that cares about Dominican Republic. And you know what they need to do? They need to enforce the law. We have a law in the country. We need to enforce the law. We you know what? A massive deportation. Anyone who doesn't have any paper, you out. Loco. Anyone? Buenas tardes, puedo decir algo brevemente. Mm. Buenas tardes y Dios le bendiga a todos. Hola, hola. Sí, hola a todos. Eh, voy a ser breve, pero precisa. En primer lugar, nosotros los dominicanos, lo primero que tenemos que hacer es Orar a Dios. Esa, esa es la primera alma poderosa que tenemos. Ya no a Dios y orar a Dios lo primero. Lo segundo, lo segundo, el pueblo está unido. El que no se quiera unir a nuestra causa, porque wow. no importa las nacionalidades del mundo que estén en contra, que hablen en, en contra de nosotros. Lo importante es que los dominicanos, aunque no estoy en mi país, pero defiendo a mi país, aunque estoy, no estoy allá. Pero nosotros los dominicanos, lo que tenemos es un himno, no importa en el país que usted esté y lo que están allá, aunque eh, el gobierno no quiera hacer nada, porque eh, yo fui, yo he visto varios likes sin ofender a nadie, no me gustan los maltratos, pero también debemos de reconocer que están pasando muchas cosas en, en la República Dominicana con los haitianos, con los vecinos, de que ya se están saliendo de la mano, entonces el pueblo tiene que hacer algo si el gobierno no quiere hacer. Porque en un live vi a varios haitianos que lo que están en los lives es fomentando odio y más odio. Y una guerra ni le conviene a ellos ni a nosotros tampoco, pero a ellos menos. Ellos Diciendo que República Dominicana es una mierda, que es un zafacón. Entonces yo le contesté con educación y altura y respeto. Si para ustedes, los haitianos, nuestro país es una mierda, que buscan a, en esa mierda ensuciándose, váyanse, váyanse, 
Porque just el leave. mundo entero. If you don't like it, just leave. Perdón, el mundo entero está hablando de los dominicanos, dominicanos. Pero no hablan de esa niña que mataron de cuatro años, que si fuera uno de, 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 de la gente grande o del presidente que se lo hiciera, Thank tuviera you, Pedro, el, 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 la fuerza y la policía en la, en la calle. Que eh, nadie dice de esa señora que le daba comida, porque son, no todos, pero la gran mayoría son mal agradecidos y son salvajes y todo el mundo lo sabe, que lo de ellos es de una vez a matar y a picar a la gente. Nadie dice de esa señora que le hacía un favor, era de darle desayuno y comida todo día. ¿Y tú sabes lo que hizo ese haitiano? La mató por robarle. Nadie habla de eso, nada más que, que es racista, que digan que somos racistas. Pero hay que levantarnos en el nombre de Jesús y hacer algo. Si el gobierno no quiere hacer algo, el pueblo va a tener que hacer algo. Que Gracias. todo el dominicano se ore, pero que se alme, de valor y también con alma. Para cuando el que quiera... Venir a, tú sabes lo que a tu propia casa, queriéndote sacar de otra nacionalidad, no es justo, entonces hay que actuar. Yo estoy en un país ajeno, yo estoy aquí en Estados Unidos, pero yo respeto la ley de este país. El día que no puede estar o que no me conviene estar, no voy a hablar mal de este país, me voy para mi país. Pero respeto la ley. Gracias. Buenas tardes. Exacto. Sí, Mike. Do you think you could change the background? Because we can't read the comments. Eso es lo normal, tú sabes, de una gente migrante cuando tú llegas a un país. No puedes llegar a ese país a tratar de hacer la misma estupidez que tú haces en el país tuyo. Y más cuando es un país. No, because right there, what what is it? What is he saying? That's Friar Montesinos. Um, he's a world-renowned friar for talking about you know in in native rights. And he exposed the, the abuses. He was the, one of the first ones to stand out there. So there he's screaming, me no black, me Dominican. That's what he's screaming. <laughs> oh, oh, I have an answer. I have an answer for... Um, I, can't, I, can't read, I can't read the comments. Me too. Yeah, yeah. But I'm, I, gonna, I, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna change it. Hold on. What's I have up an here? answer. Tu supiste el personaje favorito de ellos. A este tipo que está abajo, Alexander with the American and the Spanish flag. Apuesto a que Torito. todos tenéis una ascendencia africana. Aquí no está hablando de ascendencia africana. Aquí estamos hablando de que no me importa donde sea que tú vengas en tu país. Respeta, la, respeta mi casa. Ay, no That's what we're talking esto. about. I don't care who you are, black, pink, yellow. You come into my house, respect the shit out of my house, and that's it. Exactly. Y esa, y esa cosita que tú pusiste de que a Romeo. Dime, <laughs> macho. <laughs> Dime, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh, you know, no, I know, because I have, like, I, I do different backgrounds of different Dominicans. You know I what's crazy? I don't a like A hot him. Dominican girl. You know, I give one for the ladies, too. I, mean, I, don't don't like, I don't like Romeo, loco. Why? No, nah, but he's oh a king God. of bachata, though. He's a king I of bachata. No, he's not the king, he's not the king of bachata. Why, Ruby? What the hell? What the no, he's, what? no, he's not. No, he's not. Okay. Okay. El king of bachata. Crazy, bachata Ruby. You crazy, bro. He's crazy No, I'm not crazy. I like my Dominican bachatero. No, no ligado. Oye, tú sabes, tú sabes, una... Hater, yeah. such a hater. Bro. I'm not a hater. I don't, I don't agree with that. I don't agree with that thing. Romeo really uh, uh, put I'm uh, fucking with you guys. I'm fucking. Level. Level. No, 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 level. no. no. I'm, I'm fucking, fucking with you guys. No. A mí me gusta él. Yo he ido a ver los conciertos de él. Yo he ido. Yeah, yeah. Pero but... él no Get es tan atractivo. If you want, if you want, él no es tan atractivo como lo ponen. Yo lo vi en persona. He's not that yeah. attractive. I don't, I don't, you, you know who you should really put, macho, for us ladies, Ray Raymond Rodriguez. Mm. Nah, I don't. I don't have a picture of him. Maybe you could put it. Maybe you could put yeah, it. Yeah. I don't know how to do it. Diablo, Reina Pérez, Bucalo. I know. Like Bucalo, Ruby, because like ese es hombre Dios mío. Let me see. I'm going to put it. Let me see. Put a picture. I get la cara tuya aquí, hermano. Esa cara es fea. Esa mujer tiene la mano de sabrota. ¿Tú sabes quién es esa? Maria Trinidad Sanchez. I thought that was Mother Teresa. Mm-hmm. Maria Trinidad Sanchez. When you see some Haitians that are Haitian, too. She is Haitian. Oh, very soon she will do it. I also saw someone called Ramon de Aza. Let, let, let's see. Um, I, I have my deportation button ready. Eh, dímelo, Ramon, how are you? All the people are Haitian, according to them. You know yeah. what? That's crazy. Una cosa, yo, no están acabando el, 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 all these other lies 
de, nos están acabando, hablando mal de nosotros, diciendo que, oh, que we don't have the, the independent, uh, la ata de independencia de nosotros, que, que está en Haití. Mucha gente insultando, insultándonos a nosotros los dominicanos. Y eso me cae tan mal a mí, porque hay gente que no son ni dominicanos hablando de nosotros, que nunca han tenido ese problema encima y hablando de nosotros. Tú, It wasn't a problem 10 years ago. That's a problem now. Papa, tú, for you to be talking shit, you got to be Dominican. <laughs> Yo, I like you. I like you, man. Es que nadie, es que nadie, es que, you know what it is? You know what it is? Nobody, nobody's dealing with the shit that Dominicans are dealing with. So don't, no, you can't, you can't like basically, you know, you don't know what's going on. So if you don't know what's going on, you should go to DR. First of all, you should go to DR and like stay there for a month. Métete en el Assess the situation and then you go from there. Métete en el hoyo de fuya y vive con ellos un mes ahí. In the lawyer few, because some they all Haitian. They you live there for a month, and then you come back and talk shit about the Dominican Republic. And then it's you see, right. they wouldn't last. They wouldn't last a month. They wouldn't last a day. They wouldn't even last a day because the Haitians. Everybody, don't everybody, <laughs> like, share, subscribe, <laughs> share, <laughs> share the video <laughs> to your friends on TikTok. <laughs> Came out to the first show on TikTok. I always say something. You know what? Everybody, so bottom line, this bullshit is going on. Dominican guys stick together. And that's basically it. It's a team right now. It's, it's Dominican team versus the world. That's the bottom line. You know? you know, you know what's the crazy part about these Haitians? Let me say it louder. Why you gotta come on TikTok making fake profile with colon, colon, um, conquistadores country's flag and white men faces instead of putting your face? Like, why? Embarrassed. What's the problem of putting your own face right there? In your because flag? they're ugly and they don't and have be, confidence. And, and be proud, face. black, or whatever you want to be. <laughs> because they don't have the confidence to show Macho, their face. They don't have an identity. They don't have an identity. That's why they, 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 they don't want them to be called Haitians. They're embarrassed of being Haitians. You know what? You know what? I, you know what I, have a, what I have a and problem. And recipe is ours. What I have a problem is that you got Venezuelans, you got. Certain Puerto Rican, hablando de nosotros. Tú me... papi, papi, papi. Gente, gente que, que no tienen que no tienen experiencia, que no. Ah, no, tú lo dices no, no, por, espérate, el, por decir... el alfa y otro que anda por ahí. Déjame decirte algo. Sí, bien. Mismo. Decirte algo bien. No basura, eso. Don... Oye, subieron tres puertorriqueñas, tres mujeres boricuas a decirle, oye, no hable así de la mujer dominicana, que todas somos yeah. mujeres al final. Yeah. Ah, yeah. cante yeah. huele bicho y mierda mierda, yeah. andan para abajo no. las dos. Son dos hablando, puertos, macho. Y hablando de per, 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 Perdón que te interrumpa, Ruby, perdón. Sí, eso mismo. Anda, mira, ese mismo, el alfa, el que dice Demony, y una uh -huh. haitiana, una la, blanca, eh, ella, sí. No, ella no que es Que mira, blanca. ese eh, mismo. Ah, la usa la, 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 la crema de esta Sí, no, Monita perdón, Jane. oye. Sí, perdón, oye lo que él dijo, que las dominicanas, lo que somos una chapeadora y lo que nos damos uh -huh. la narga por papeles, y que los hombres vienen aquí a yeah. Estados Unidos a vender droga. Y yo le dije a él, bueno, mi amor, yo soy dominicana y estoy honradamente trabajando y no le ha dado la narga a nadie. Por, Dame un segundo. Pero entonces, 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 entonces yo le dije a él, eh, si los dominicanos aquí vienen a vender droga, ustedes se la comen como comida. Y que nosotros somos, eh, 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 que le tenemos envidia porque ellos son ciudadanos. Yo le dije, bueno, mi amor, yo no le tengo envidia a gente loca, ni que se hacen los locos y arrecotados. No le tengo envidia a ustedes. <risa> El porque el ellos dicen que pueden al mundo entero nosotros los dominicanos aún no somos ciudadanos y, y donde nos queremos y proponer ir vamos y ellos con tú y su ciudadanía no pueden ir al mundo entero Está porque muchos están en su país en, en rico y no pueden venir a Estados Unidos oye bien sí, eso al, oye, pero eso tú, tú sabes que es lo más puerco ¿quién le va a tener envidia a espérate, una espérate. gente? La tipa que tú dices, la haitiana esa que es clara, la crema de Sí, esa, esa misma, esa yo misma. Le digo, yo le digo, ella se llama Manu Tille, yo le digo, Esa misma, Moni, yo la hablo Monita Yen, cremita blanca, así que yo le digo a ella. <risa> eh, que se peine un moño para atrás, se pone un, un, una cola laseada, cuando se quita, se quita la, la extensión que tiene atrás, es un brillo para adelante que va loca. Sí, esa ellos tres están <risa> informando ella, oye, a todo el mundo estaba, para que no tengan odio. Espérate, ella estaba de que no, porque esos dominicanos, ellos hacen esto. Tieto, porque yo vine a Chile y yo que sé cuánto y subí una chilena. Entonces, si tanto te habla mal del hombre blanco, ¿qué tú haces en Chile? 
Exacto. No, porque yo que sé cuánto, digo yo. Pero los chilenos no quieren yo saber. Soy... Pero que lo que te digo, subí una chilena no, con ella. No, los chilenos no quieren saber de Entonces ella. Entonces le pregunto. No, porque la, la, no, la, la, la dominicana y dominicano son puya gallina y puya burra. Y digo yo. Y está con el boricua. Y, 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 y le dijo al boricua de que. Eh, el boricua dijo de que esos son, ellos son unos monos negros. Y digo Exactamente. Yo, Espérate. Y digo yo, el boricua le está diciendo a ella que, ellos, que los dominicanos son unos monos negros. Eso es un sucio. Pero, espérate, tipo. pero déjeme terminar. Y ella va y le responde a él: Ay, me gusta tu voz. Animal, ahí está diciendo que los lo, lo negros son monos. ¿Y qué tú eres, mamá? Ajá, ajá. Yo le dije eso, perdón. Yo le dije eso el mismo. Pero dice: Todo lo que tú estás diciendo, dilo delante de un hombre. Ella cara a cara. Ella se consiguió a la mujer. Pero ustedes no entendieron. Él dijo que los dominicanos son unos monos negros. Sí, no, ¿verdad? yo sé. Yo, Entonces, yo le dije al ella, alfa. Ella es una haitiana de piel clara. Uh -huh. Ahí es que tú ves donde se muestra la estupidez y la ignorancia de esta gente. Esa no, pero yo le dije. Ella es perdón. un idiota, títere de él. Él está, está llamando a la gente negra mona. Y tú eres haitiana, descendente africana. Ñame, tú eres negra. Yo le dije al sí. alfa y a, y, a, y a Demony. Pero díganle eso a un hombre cara a cara, ve. Pero porque yo mamá hablando y hablando, yo pero no se lo viste. ¿Tú sabes por qué me bloqueó? Guay. ¿Tú sabes por qué me bloqueó? Porque yo subí y lo puse en su puesto. Digo, mira, huele bicho. Primeramente, el crack que tú te metes por la nariz, te lo tiene blandito como el paquete y no te crees si eres preco. <risa> ¡Oh, me bloqueó! Ay, <risa> el hombre que ha nacido una mujer o es preco, lo tiene sí, chiquito, no se vio ni el paquete y le tiembla. No, porque yo le dije, si una dominicana te hizo algo, fue una, no todas. Ay, no. ¿Me entiende? Y sí, entonces bien, yo le dije a él, perdón, no. yo le dije a él, solo si es el concepto que ustedes tienen de la dominicana, no se casen. Porque vale, si para tengo... ti las dominicanas se casan por papeles, ¿para qué se casan? El Porque punto ustedes no, le van a el, el, el punto, el punto claro, no hablar pues. que la dominicana, en total en común es generaliza, que un hombre se suba una vez a hablar de una mujer, de impuestos de nacionalidad, de general. mujeres. Usted me excusa, usted lo tiene chiquito, es preco, la coca no le dio, le brinda como el paquete. Usted no sirve. Como el <risa> Madre, es que ellos no tienen moral para hablar de nadie, de nada, sí. ninguna me nación. Ellos eso, no tienen moral, ni los hombres ni las mujeres. Oye, no, sí, no. Me gustó me eso, la que la ley. Ley. Digo, mira. Pero, Y eso me cayó tan mal a mí, porque yo tengo mis hermanas. A mí no mi, me cae mal, yo lo mando a la mierda. Y todo ¿Tú sabes, eso, ¿tú sabes algo lo que pasa, viejo? Yo te voy a decir algo también que tengamos que tener cuenta. Yo no digo, usted quizá lo escuchan ellos hablando, pero tengamos que tener cuenta porque muchos haitianos andan poniendo la bandera de los otros países para poner en, en pelea. Fue lo que yo dije. Yo no hay el... los, porque te voy, te voy a decir verdad. ¿Eh? Yo personalmente creo que lo, nosotros los dominicanos, eh, los cubanos, los boricuas y, 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 lo, y, y también, también los venezolanos. Yo tengo pilar de amigos venezolanos. Esa gente no andan hablando más de nosotros. No, 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 Ellos hay una ahí que dice que es venezolana. Ellos aparecen. ¿Y por ellos, ustedes ellos son así? Ellos ponen la cuenta con nombre a pa y pon, se ponen Ay, no. Señores, señores, una pregunta a todo el hombre. Que espérate, espérate, es. espérate, porque hay alguien nuevo aquí. JD1, eh, por favor, eh, te prende tu micrófono. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. JD1. Yeah, yeah, yeah. ¿Cómo estamos? ¿Cómo estamos? Eh, eh, Saludos, todo, bendiciones. Eh, nada, tranquilo, patria. Eh, estamos aquí escuchándolo. Very interested in, in the conversation. Finally, I found people from around my area, I think. Um, It's a pleasure to be here. I'm going to stay low and just listening because you, you guys have a great conversation. ¿Quién yo soy? Tú sabes que yo soy patria de la nueva orden. So, patria muerte. Tranquilo, maestro. Bien. Yeah. Tú sabes, sabes, sabes que ese tato de Fray Antonio welcome, Montesquieu welcome. está por ahí por mi casa, por ahí, por ese vecindario que yo soy. De ahí es que yo soy. No, pero qué bueno que tú viniste aquí. Eso es, yo quiero un espacio... Eso porque yo abro los lives eh, para meter gente nueva, para ellos hablar con nosotros, si tú eres dominicano, o, y también hispano, porque si es un espacio no, de oye, hispano. Oye, esa gente, esa gente, yo no, know, ese tipo hablando mucha mierda, y yo lo que quisiera fuera tenerlo al frente de mí para partirle la cara. No, ¿Tú claro me sí. ¿Tú me entiendes? Porque es que habla está mucha llegando, mierda. es que está llegando, es que está llegando el momento ya que los dominicanos, cuando alguien se ponga a hablar de pendejadas, presentemente, Tú lo tienes, uno, uh -huh. uno, uno va a tener que empezar ya a, 
a poner a hacer la cosa ya física porque que ya la vaina ya está llegando un, a un no estoy analizando los boricuas porque mira mi mujer no, no es, todo. Mi mujer no es todo, boricua, boricua, boricua no, mis no hijos son, son mitad y mitad y la, todos los boricuas que yo conozco son, mira muchachos, esa gente aparecen, dan la vida. Aparecen uh -huh. algunos, aparecen algunos más ahí que empiezan Un a hablar. Un que, que lo que le gustan es envolver la masa. Claro. ¿Tú ves? O que está casado con una haitiana, tú sabes que... Hay, ah, que así que mismo, haitiana, tiene no, que no, ser. Pero regularmente, regularmente los boricuas no hablan mal de los hispanos. Y no si ustedes le ven... los boricuas son de nosotros, claro, tú lo sí. sabes. Si ustedes si no usted le ven la boca al tipo que habla mal de nosotros, ustedes se ríen a este tipo, le faltan entre dientes al alfa ese. El porque, el, el porque ha quitado su cara. Señores, Oye. usted, 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 usted deben escuchar. Ay, como, señores, yo soy rubillo. ¿Usted ve la dos espada que yo tengo ahí? Así me invito a la lengua mía de Fernando. Pero oye. Espérate un momentico. Vela, eh, eh, Bella, eh, eh sí. what, do you, what do you mean you're not black? You're Dominican. No, yeah, yeah. Um, no, I'm asking you. Um, Here we go. Oh, wait, we go. hold on for a second. People don't, let's not cut people off. Um, are Dominicans a race? No. Wait, wait, hold on, hold on. Let her answer. Yeah, 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 yeah. Can I answer? Right, I'm a, I'm Can I answer? Can I answer? Because, hold on, hold Can on. I answer? People, mute your mics. Talk what you want, baby. Mute, mute your mics and let her talk, please. Mutense. All of you, all of you. All right, go ahead. Okay, listen, this is what I have to say. Okay, I'm from West Africa, right? Or like Caribbean or whatever. Listen. You know how, listen, You're listen. You're from West Africa and Caribbean. The, wh 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 which one? No, is it? I mean like I'm trying to like I'm not saying I'm Caribbean. I'm West where African. Are you from? I'm oh, listen, you're from listen, listen, where, listen. But where in Africa? Where in Africa? I'm Guinean and Sierra Leonean, right? Let me tell you something. Okay, West Africa. So I'm trying to make an example to y'all. Okay, so basically, right? I'm from Guinea. I'm from Sierra Leone. That's my ethnicity. But my race is what? My race is black. African, yeah, African. It's not African. I'm. I am African. My race is not African. African is not a race. African is what you're. What you are. That's what your you color, guys are. Your color. You're. You're black. Yeah. Your color. Yeah, I'm black. Basically. Your color. Yeah. Exactly goes for Dominican. Please don't unmute your mic. What you color offended, are Dominicans? Offended. What color are Dominican? Dominicans? No, listen, listen, listen. Dominicans. I'm not gonna say every Dominican is black because not every Dominican black is black. Puerto Ricans, Dominicans, a lot of Hispanic people, they are mixed with different things. They are mixed with different races. So not all Dominican people are black. They have different mixtures of Italian, maybe like, uh, I don't know, like white, maybe black. They're all mixed up at one. At one. But I know some Dominicans that are, are black. Yeah. You can't lie. Um, so I'm not saying Dominicans are, are the, like, I don't know. Like, I'm not saying Dominicans aren't black, but they are black. Some of them are black. Yeah, I agree with that. So mm. I feel like some Dominicans I see on this app and say I'm I'm Dominican I'm not black but you look black as hell why are you like come on now oh uh, can I answer that uh, I, I, I yeah yeah of course because I'm I've answered this like a hundred times uh, uh, okay I, I do it I do it I'm ready for that yeah. so this is <clears throat> this is a, wait, this wait, is wait, a wait, thing wait, wait. I'm sorry to cut you off I'm sorry to cut you off first of all you in the comments first of all you sound stupid the ones that are the ones that are the don't look, that don't look at the comments <laughs> No, don't listen don't Dominicans. listen to the comments because if you do that trust me you're gonna lose it <clears throat> this is the thing the dominican republic is a tri-racial country we are not fully black white or indigenous we are mixed so instead of dividing people by skin tones hair type or whatever race or that thing we don't use mm -hmm. the word race or afro or black white or afro dominican or Euro dominican or whatever we use dominican and that's it if you look into my family in this and everybody, my brother, my mom is green eyes, blonde hair. My father is oh, Miss All right, all right, all right, hold and on. And that's I, it. It's, it's, it's look, look, why are we explaining? I, how, many time, uh, how many times has the audience heard this? I, put a number out there. Put a number out there. Yo ni me acuerdo. Where we, where, we, where we explain ourselves to people. Like, tell me, how many times have we explained ourselves? Yo macho. Yo, if, if the, See, I, I understand. That's yo, why Marcia, I said I understand. Look, 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 look. Yo, let, let me say something. Anti-black or racist. Let me say something, Marcia, please. It, it is what when it I'm is. I'm speaking. I'm speaking for me. My problem is the people, Dominicans that are really All right, black. So, I'm gonna that speak act like they're not. Like, okay, like, like, why do you, you care? Care? I mean, I'm gonna speak I mean, for me they now. Say, they 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 say, and then you sit on our table and then you're going to see the difference. You're going to have somebody as dark as you. You're going to have somebody white is like a European. And you're going to have somebody in between. 
That's not what I'm saying. You're not understanding. You're not comprehending what I'm trying to say to you. What I'm saying is, I'm gonna tell you, I'm gonna ask you this question. I have problems with Dominicans. Why do you not even care? Just Dominicans. You're not even Dominican, baby. Why do you care? It doesn't matter. I'm just. It saying, does I matter. We don't Dominicans. talk about West Africans. We don't talk about West okay, Africans. Okay, because guess what? So we why don't do, do you, that. Why are you? Why are you getting so mad? Why are you getting so mad over a color? Why are you getting 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 mad over a color? Like yeah, getting... no, but don't Listen, why you come and disrespect you... me? Yeah, exactly. Nobody disrespected you. My opinion, I don't care. You're getting disrespectful. Oh, why are you time, getting mad at time. over Dominicans identifying uh, as whatever color? Who cares? Okay, not question. Even because question. I'm speaking on the ones that are black. I'm not but speaking on... But why do you care? You never answered Listen, that question. Why um, do you care? This is why? my question. How old she is? Because she sounds like a minor. How old are you? I'm a minor. I'm very much adult. I'm a 20 well, years old. Like why one. do you You're care? You're a minor. You're not even 21, though. And you acted in a conversation that doesn't have nothing to do with your country. We don't talk about your exactly. people, your own country. Whatever Dominicans want to qualify themselves if their problem, because that's their house, their land, their language, and their people. I don't think that doesn't matter. Why does she Hold like? It doesn't make any mic, sense. Because bro, nobody has an issue. Because I called you that because you're being disrespectful. You're mad because I'm coming for you. You disrespect. You disrespect <laughs> her calling him the the the. the exactly. You know that word. Sitting disrespectful on me because. Okay, macho, why is that type? Because I want to have a conversation. Okay. She's getting she's getting so angry over how Dominicans identify us. That's ridiculous. You sound ridiculous. Like who the hell gets mad over w what we are? Like that's and you're not even Dominican. Your family's not even Dominican. Your man is not even Dominican. You did not come out of a a Dominican coochie. Why are you this upset over Dominican? Nobody's Republic? coming over Dominicans. Go I'm speaking on the ones that are black. That's about there West is no African black Dominican. Mix race worry Dominican. About West Africa and why they bleed so goddamn much. Oh Don't yeah, why do y'all bleed so goddamn much? Why did the black no, we don't bleed? bleed. The only <laughs> why do they bleed so goddamn? Huh? Huh? Right, well, hold on, hold on, people, hold on, hold on. Uh, Bell, uh, well, hold on, people, mute yourself. If you have background noise, please mute yourself. If you're not speaking, thank you. Bell, uh, I understand. Um, maybe you spoke to a Dominican. I, I see your picture. You have like blonde streaks, so you you like looking kind of mixed. I, I understand that. Um, but someone who's darker than you says, I'm not black. Um, he kind of looks at his skin and he knows that, you know, most likely they're from Africa. Um, there's no denying that. But he doesn't subscribe to black culture or, or like black philosophies and, and stuff. No, because listen, that's not what I'm getting. I'm not trying to yell on, this, on your on your live and disrespect when call people beach, the B word and all this. You stuff did. You kind of did. I didn't mean to do that. I got on a character though. because. Yeah, it's not about me, but you I said. I got on a character. Though. I got yeah, another character because it's though. like she's telling um, me I can't speak on nothing. It's not, I don't have to be Dominican. I don't have to be Indian. I'm Dominican Chinese Republic. You can speak on, on whatever anybody. other country, but not I can Dominican speak Republic on because you because you're not if Dominican, I want to. Baby. What you gonna do about it? You're not. Nothing. You want what? Where are you at? Nothing. Nothing. Where, where, where you, you at? at? Where are you at? No, you just said I'm not gonna do anything about I it. I'm asking you, on you. Where you at? Columbus, Ohio. Where you at? Pull up. Oh, okay. I'm in business. Texas, baby. You're Under 16 your hours away from me. We don't like You're 16 the ghetto hours away from wow, me. That's so ghetto. That's so ghetto. She like, is ghetto. Okay. Get she is ghetto. Yeah, this is Bye. why we I'm deny done. we're black. This is I'm why done. we deny we're black. That's the reason we deny. Don't bring me that ghetto shit. You right before, right, hold on, hold on, hold on baby, you a baby. I could be your mama. Hold you on for a second. Hold on for a second. Um, uh, Let me ask you a question. Do you rather get confused for a Haitian or a Dominican? said what do you rather get confused for a haitian or a dominican wait can you make that can you make that clear because what you mean like if i I'm saw you myself and i if i saw you right now if mm -hmm. i might run into you right now i go hey are you haitian or mm -hmm. hey are you dominican what question do you rather me ask if it doesn't matter if i'm haitian or dominican i really don't care that's oh, not my issue. You don't, what, what I was do you speaking on, what I was speaking confused on, for, Haitian or Dominican? It doesn't Just matter. Answer I don't really one. care. That's answer not one. what I was speaking okay. on, though. Okay, where do you rather get deported to, Haiti or DR? It wouldn't matter to me. I really it don't wouldn't have matter? Okay, either. you're going to, uh, to think, to Haiti. Bye. Bye. <laughs> no, it don't matter.
Yeah, she's so like she came in here like all angry about wh yeah. why she's not, color that's and all a that child, stuff. Like, I have never seen not somebody 20 get that was, angry. Twenty years old. Yeah, that's not a twenty yeah, year old. You, that's a child. You, you think so? Below twenty. No, yeah, that's below 20. Yeah, that would be 16 she or 17. Like she's like 17 or so. Something oh, like that. Okay. Oh. There is no 20 years old Latina, I mean, in the Hispanic community that I know that behaves like that. Esa mujer está en jipeta montaña. Well, yeah, yeah, you know. We don't talk minutes. about West Africa, bro. Why is she yeah, coming we, in here? We really exactly. don't. We really, we're really Dominican centric here. You know, the only time we talk is about Haiti because they're flooding our, our home. That's why. And, you know, we talk mm -hmm. about the flood because you know how the water keeps inching up and up? That, that's why. That part right there. You know, so this is this is why uh, we talk about it. So the woman behind me in the screen is Maria Trinidad Sanchez. A great example of a Dominican woman, a fighter, a leader. One of, one of the, the founders of the Dominican Republic right here. So when it shows you that we have this kind of ultra machista uh, a society that's far from the truth. So many women gave forth to the birth of the Dominican Republic. <laughs> Everybody like, share, subscribe, tap, tap, tap the screen, subscribe to my YouTube, King Macho, the first show, share with like at least five, eight, 10, or even 20 friends. Let's get this life popping. So um, when, when the young girl came in, yeah, she did seem kind of upset. Like you, you, you sense it in the voice, does, us denying we're black, you know, quote unquote, get people upset all the time. Hmm. And we and we always ask ourselves why so upset because um, if I look, I, I've never really asked anyone racially, you know, if I, if I see a Pakistani, right, and I go, "Are you Indian?" He goes, "I'm Pakistani." They're like, nah, you Indian. And I'm Pakistani. And I go, no, you Indian. You Indian. It's like <laughs> that type of game. You know what's crazy, Marshall? When I see let's say dark skin i don't ask the word i say hey where you from because i don't look for your race i say where you from country name that's it i don't be like are you this are you that that's your race like come on man no we don't, i don't be asking that when i see a hispanic person i be like where you from that's what i ask that's it but these people oh you're black you're a black woman that speaks spanish and i'm like what lo único negro mío es más yo ni eso tengo negro yeah, and that's the thing. Um, they they usually direct it to us. You see how it was like, no, you, not you guys, the blacker ones. So this is what they're doing. They're trying to separate, quote unquote, the black Dominicans from us Dominicans, you know, and kind of like join their struggle, their fight against our struggle and our fight. And ultimately, I say, I leave it up to those Dominicans. I leave it up to you. You choose. We had a CUNY professor who teaches Dominican history, and he's Haitian. And he's on Twitter getting mad at us because we're representing what Dominicans are. They want to make Dominicans into black ones, even, even the ones that aren't even black. That's the thing. If you look like, you know, you're on the blacker side and you want to, go ahead, go kill yourself. But, uh, on a lot of yourself. I didn't mean it like that, TikTok, okay? Um... But all the other ones, the ones that are that are mixed, lighter, and whatever, like now we're like Hispanic. Like it's it is. It is they're trying to separate Dominicans in that way and recruiting certain people. It's a dirty fuck. It's a dirty game. Like how they recruit people to use them against us. That's crazy, right? Like when you think about the whole thing, and some Dominicans like openly fall for it. Reina should know. Um, like we have Dominicans that see. Um, People talk really bad about Dominicans, like really bad, and still be friends with that person. I'm like, damn, you don't have no backbone. Like you'll do anything for clout. Like you'll do, you'll you'll play the status quo to get clout on your name. It's weak and it's pathetic, you know. And I've seen, and I ran into it, you know, um, on Twitter. Is the Vendepatria, which we will have. Vendepatria hunting season is coming back, people. Which is, I would say, people really enjoy that series. I'm, fa I'm famous for that. You can know me for that. We're gonna have the Dominican membership card uh, episode as well. I'm gonna lay down the details of what it means and what it is, what it takes to be Dominican in 2024 and 2025, going beyond. We're we're changing the new definition of what it means to be Dominican now.
It's like we're writing our own people's constitution. You know, so uh, everyone like, share, subscribe. Remember, everyone here should be subscribed to my YouTube. Everyone here, if you want to get behind the scenes, I'm going to open up my Patreon as well. You're going to get behind the scenes to certain editing, certain episodes that are a little bit too raunchy. I'll put it on my Patreon, and you just subscribe for a certain dollar amount a month, and you're going to get kind of the behind-the-scenes viewership that no one gets. So subscribe. <laughs> Come into the Patreon, on YouTube, TikTok. Twitter as well. Um, and, and, you know, me, I even spoke to people up here, you know, um, about talking about race. I don't really like explaining myself, and this is why when Ruby was explaining herself, I mean, I think I've heard Ruby say that like, at least over 100 times already. Like, honestly, like, it's like a script. Yo it's, ni me acuerdo it's, yeah, veces. it's like, it's, oh, you do, and then we got to explain that we're some mixed type of people, and it's like, I'm done explaining, like, hey, you think the way you think? I, I mean, I, I don't know what to tell you, man. It, it is what it is. And if you hate it, I, I can't help you. You know, go have a Coke, you know, go, you know, have an Avo. I, I don't know. I really can't help you in that department. And this was a young gentleman that wanted to come up here too. Wanting to meet up with me and fight me because you're mad that I am Dominican. That's crazy. Yo, I'm <laughs> telling about you. my color. <laughs> uh, you know, so like, so and Ruby should know. It's just like, this kind of like, they hate our pride. They They, they feel like, since we're in this country, we should strip our pride. They, they, they look at us like, oh, you're nothing. You shouldn't have pride. And then when we have pride and we're so happy and we don't kind of bend or fold to their norms, they really get upset. Exactly. But, they, love, they would love to. This, 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 this country, this, this gente de nosotros, los dominicanos, ha sido envidiado por muchos países. En una buena o una mala forma, pero mira... Tú sabes toda la gente que le gustaría tener, este, tener solamente la felicidad que nosotros llevamos y la patria que nosotros llevamos, el país que nosotros llevamos. I mean, we are country that everybody loves us. Everybody would love to be like us. So, eh, yo, soy de la, yo soy de la gente de, 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 de atrás y, y nosotros siempre hemos tratado bien a los haitianos. We love them. But it's okay. It's not even a, about a color. But the problem with them is that they suddenly decided eh, para su beneficio hablar mal de nosotros y, y habló de una forma de, de quemarnos en toda la parte and, and now we have a problem uh, we have a big problem it's not that we don't hate him but, but now it, it came to the conclusion that they're going to have to they're going to have to go to the, to the side eh, tienen problema eso porque que ya la gente despertó y entonces el problema de nosotros es que nosotros queremos tanto y, y le damos tanto y tanto y tanto y mira, mira una de las clases de la mala fe que están usando, que están mandando a todas sus mujeres preñar y, y estamos, son 100 diarios. O sea, el, eh, hace un, el mes pasado fueron 5 mil. And that's a problem. So, eh, mi gente, voy a bajar para pa, pa que suba otra gente. I, I feel proud to be, to, to be here because, I, you know, now I know that there's people on this side, eh, los extranjeros de nosotros, los que estamos aquí. Eh, felicidades a todos y, y buena suerte. Yeah, um, I'm going to close the live for now. Uh, I might be back later on. Going to take a little break, but everyone, go to my YouTube, King Macho the First Show. Did Here. King Macho the First Show on TikTok. Twitter as well, you can follow me there. And it's still season five, Colonizations, Dominicans. We are colonizing. All right, see you soon.